A substitute bus driver will no longer be working with Manatee County Schools after yesterday's school bus crashed with a semi that left dozens hurt. Tonight, we're getting a clear look and listen at what was happening inside that bus just before the crash. Our Eric Waxler took a look at that video. He's live tonight in Bradenton. Eric? Officials say it all started when this driver thought one of the students behind him was too loud. So he was trying to hand back what's called a courtesy note. It's basically a written reprimand. But as he did that, officials say he lost sight of what was directly ahead of him. Inside the bus, video shows driver Charles Orr trying to hand back a piece of paper. School officials say he was looking at students in the rearview mirror and didn't see a truck up ahead. The camera was knocked down from the impact, changing the angle. Chaos and confusion followed. The driver tried to keep students in their seats. But with the dashboard crushed, the driver was trapped or was not able to stop the bus. Some students jumped out through an emergency exit and workers from a nearby car wash came to help. One of them actually got onto the bus as it was still moving. I got the bus, it won't stop. You got emergency brakes? Eventually, the bus did stop or could be heard screaming in pain. <laughs> 23 of the 26 students on the bus were taken to the hospital. School officials say none had serious injuries, but those who walked away with just bumps and bruises were still obviously shaken. I was, we were scared, crying, because we thought we, were, we didn't know what to do. Now, Orr did have a clean driving record. Because he was a substitute driver, the district was able to dismiss him without any kind of due process. He broke his hand in the accident and was cited for careless driving. The school district says they will pay the medical bills for any of the students that were hurt in that accident. Live in Bradenton, Eric Waxler, ABC Action News.